Good morning, happy Thursday, September 2nd, kiddos. Let's get to some birthdays. German, Ardon Bernal, happy birthday to you. Clever Villanueva, happy birthday to you. Abby Gazaway, happy birthday. Anastasia Kim, happy birthday, Anastasia. And to Kyla Lyman, happy birthday to you. I hope that you guys get to pick your dinner. Will it be tacos? Will it be pizza? Or maybe the most delicious thing that your parent makes at home? For my daughter, it was always chicken parmesan. That's what she wanted me to make on her birthday. Um, all right, guys, no staff birthdays today. Let's get to some shout outs. Miss Raglan would like to shout out Magali and Nancy for working so, so hard in math. And she would like to shout out Tyrell for always working hard in everything. So good job, Magali and Nancy and Tyrell. Guys, I bet it's not easy for them to work hard all the time, but they are persistent when they are um, in a tough spot, they just keep going. They look around for the help that's offered and they just keep going. So thank you, Magali, Nancy, and Terrell for your persistence. My favorite word. Um, Juan would like to shout out Ms. Hartman for being a great teacher. Thank you, Ms. Hartman, sixth grade math teacher. You're having an impact on Juan and many others, I know. Candace would like to shout out Mark and Jason for being such good friends. Thank you, Mark and Jason. Good friends make life better. Um, Jess would like to shout out Anastasia. Happy birthday, Anastasia, she says. Thank you for being my bestie since second grade. Anastasia, you got two birthday shout outs today. That's awesome. And this one is an anonymous shout out to Day and Miles. So Day and Miles, I hope you know who sent that to you. I don't know who it is. Um, and then this one's a super cool one from Miss Griffiths. She's got shout outs for two of her entire classes. Her first academic class is like on fire, always on task, she says, ready to learn, working hard. When she circles the room, every single kid, you guys, that means 100% is doing exactly what she has prepared for them to do. Nobody has to be redirected. They're just completely on task in this period. And Ms. Griffith had a sub last week and the note said, and I quote, absolute perfection. That is a big deal, first academic. And I bet that's not always easy, but you do it anyway, right? Because you're persistent. Love that. My candy cart's going to have to make my way over to you. Um, second academic from Miss Griffith as well. They are also super high achieving. Maybe maybe not quite as quiet, Miss Griffith says, but super high achieving and they take such pride in their grades. The class average for the first test was a 94%. That is amazing. And eighth grade algebra is a very important subject that gets you ready for high school. So second academic, good job. I will come out to your first and second, Miss Griffith, with some candy. And thank you for taking the time to shout them out. And thank you, Miss Griffith, for teaching them and loving them so well. All right, kiddos, it's a big day for announcements. It's a big day for meetings. After school today, volleyball interest meeting. It's not a tryout. I've gotten some emails about a tryout. It's just a club, right? So it's just a meeting for you to learn about our volleyball club. That's after school today. Also after school today is student council. And remember, I will be there to listen to your concerns about um, dress code. I wanna have a nice um, proper dialogue about it. So I'll be there after school to just listen to your thoughts. But um, tomorrow morning, there will also be a second opportunity for student council, and that will be at 8.20 in the morning. Um, swim meeting, September 15th. Soccer tryouts, uh, September 13th, 15th, 16th, and 17th. And today, uh, tomorrow is PBIS movie day if you have 10 paw points. Once this PBIS celebration is over, we'll tell you about the next PBIS event um, to get you really excited about that and just start earning those paw points like crazy. And finally, food fight. Yesterday we had an awesome day. We have 430 things now for our food fight, canned goods. I've got mine here ready to bring them into school today so that I can contribute too to the families in Duluth who are struggling with food insecurity and don't know where their next meal might come from, guys, which happens a lot more often than we think. So let's do some good for our community and let's also be Coleman at the same time because 
Why not? We're amazing. And we have more kids than they do. So we should definitely be Coleman. All right, kiddos, today in Wildcat Pride is your last day of classworks practice. Woohoo! Today is the last day of math practice. Tomorrow we're going to have some fun in Wildcat Pride. And um, then next week, your counselors have prepared some awesome lessons for you. And on September 20th, we'll roll out our big Wildcat Pride program where we will place you and special places to get you exactly what you need to be successful. Hey, we're doing whatever it takes to make you have a good year. You do whatever it takes to make yourself have a good year. Persist, 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 even when things are tough. That's the secret to all success, guys, is to just keep going and work hard. Um, love you. See you in the hallways and classrooms. Bye.